Okay guys, let's start with simple and basic web server example. You can find this code in examples. It is named as hello server. I'll edit codes in sublime editor. If you like to use it, you can download it from sublimetext.com. Okay. Whenever server root is requested, this web server sends message hello from ESP8266. Let's load this program to ESP. I have node MCU with ESP12E. Server started. Let's check it out. When server root is requested, we get hello message. If we try to access some other resource, it shows file not found. It seems to function as expected. Next we shall try to put some simple HTML in Arduino sketch. You can find many examples at w3school.com. Let's write something like hello from ESP. Now to put this HTML in Arduino sketch, we need to convert this HTML to C string format. You can use some online tool or software for this conversion. One such example is tomeco.net. There are many useful tools here and you have to select text to CPP converter. Copy HTML to source text field and press convert button. Ok, now we have HTML page in C string format. We can copy it and paste it in Arduino sketch. Let's declare a constant character type array. We have to use progmem keyword to put this array in program memory. That is needed because microcontrollers have usually small amount of data memory and if we put all static web pages in data memory that is waste of resources. Ok, now instead of sending hello from ESP, we can send index page. New content type will be text slash html and instead of using server.send we have to use server.send underscore p. That function sends web page from program memory instead of data memory. Now let's compile and load this code to ESP8266. Ok, it works alright. In next lecture, we shall practice another example. Stay tuned.